In this video, let us understand about photosynthesis by algae and other parts of plant. Now if you would have seen one of the earlier videos relating to photosynthesis, we told you that photosynthesis is generally done by leaves. Okay? But what can happen is that in certain other plants, let's say something like a cactus. Have you seen cactuses? These are basically of several shape and very hard kind of or you can have round cactuses also so in these cases certain other parts of the plant like let's say a stem or a branch can also do photosynthesis. It's not only the leaves but even a stem or a branch. The condition is that these have to be green. Why green? Because they have certain amount of chlorophyll in themselves which makes them green in color. And by using these green colors they are able to do the process of photosynthesis which is namely producing of food for the plant. And that's how basically they do the photosynthesis. Now, in some cases, even algae, algae is basically, it's a plant-like organism. Now, have you ever seen certain ponds? Let's say a swimming pool or a pond. During rains and certain other parts when this happens, you will see certain green green kinds of formations which forms here. Anywhere where you have collected water which is still and you know which is not moving, you see these kinds of green green things. These are basically algae. Now these algae, even though they are not actually plant, they are plant like organisms, they produce food using photosynthesis because this green color that they have is nothing but chlorophyll. But if you pull one of them out, they are different from plants because unlike plants, they do not have roots or stems they don't have a root, they don't have stems, they don't have any kinds of leaves. But they are still able to carry out the process of photosynthesis due to the presence of chlorophyll within them. 